welcome Jeff Love! Um, thank you so much for having me, Youth Empowerment Network Toronto. It is so nice to see you here. Thank you for joining me and thank you for being here to listen to some of my songs and listening to my story. So, as Louis said, I am a music and French teacher in schools. I'm also a singer-songwriter. I think, well, how many musicians are there here? Do you play an instrument or sing? Yes. And you guys are just in high school. You guys are just beginning your musical journeys. Well, I went to school at the University of Toronto for music education, and you know, I grew up doing the classical piano lessons, the flute lessons, and I really liked to, to, to sing, but I never started songwriting until third year university. That was a much later in life um, than you guys. Um, and, but the reason why I really stuck to songwriting is because I found it super satisfying and super fulfilling because instead of playing other people's um, pieces from a long time ago, I got to write music that really spoke to who I was as a person and really expressed my deepest thoughts and feelings. And so one of the things that I really like to write about or I think about when I'm songwriting is self-confidence and self-esteem. And I think I have improved in terms of my self-confidence over the years. But of course, it's something I struggle with every single day. So I wrote this song called Smile. And it's basically about believing in yourself and not being ashamed of who you are, what you look like, what you do, how you speak, how you dress. Because none of that matters, right? All that matters is that we're kind to each other. We put a smile on our faces. And we focus on spreading joy to those around us. So this is smile. Don't understand it. Why do you leave me out? It's your intention to always make me doubt. Is it a question? I'm a physical work. Do I need to explain myself? Ooh. You think I'm a nerd? Yeah. 
hard it is to get a, to write a song first, but then to somehow get it produced and somehow release it. So if you guys like that song, it's you can listen to it online. But anyways, um, going back to songwriting and why I use songwriting on a daily basis, um, I really like songwriting because it's become a very healthy outlet for me to express myself, right? Um, so I, when I was really not confident in myself, I wrote a song. But I've also been sad a lot of other times, whether it be maybe losing friendships or losing loved ones, like grandparents or parents, aunts, and uncles. So a few years ago, when my grandma was diagnosed with cancer, I kind of turned to songwriting as a safe space, and somehow a song came out supernaturally, and I was able to record it just in time um, for my grandmother to listen to it quite a few times. And even though she didn't understand English, I think she really liked the intent behind the Thank you for 
Achieving, amazingly talented, intelligent, um, young leader in this room. Raise your hand. That's all of you, so please raise your hand. <laughs> so I know that just looking at you, I can see so much potential. I cannot wait for all the amazing things that you guys are going to do in your lifetime. Um, I'm sure you are already achieving so many great goals nowadays, and I can't wait in 10 years' time what that's going to be like later on. Um, but of course, through our journeys in life, there will always be obstacles, right? And so even if you have these big goals, there will be a lot of challenges and obstacles getting in your way. And sometimes you will feel discouraged. However, it's important that we need to embrace all these ups and downs because they're super important to leading us where we need to be at the end of the day. So I wrote this, I'm gonna leave you with one more song, it's called Roller Coaster. I know, kind of, kind of sounds cheesy at first, I thought so too, but then I sang it for some friends and they thought it was quite relatable, so I hope you guys can relate to it as well. And of course, I like to write songs when I'm happy and also sad, and I hope and encourage you to continue using music as a healthy outlet for, you, for your own expression. And I hope that one day, when you're using music and songwriting to your advantage, then maybe it'll also unleash your next new big idea to conquer the world. <laughs> okay, this is roller coaster. I hope you guys like it. Thank you so much for having me. Only way for 
Oh, yeah.